going to show you about uh, harmonics in a closed pipe. Notice I have this very large uh, graduated cylinder and notice it's closed at this end and open on that end. You wouldn't have to use this big of a cylinder, you could use a smaller one, you just have to have a higher frequency. Inside of it are these uh, styrofoam pellets, you get them, you know, I, we have them in our uh, electrostatics kit. Where you get them, I don't exactly know. Uh, someone said you can get them at Hobby Lobby or something. So I'm going to spread them out. Okay, so that they're roughly evenly distributed. I'm going to put them up close to the large speaker. I've tried this with the CPO speakers and they don't work very well. It may not be powerful enough. I need to make sure it's pretty darn close to the center of that. All right, let's turn on our speaker. About 150. I know this is around 180 because I've obviously done this before. You can measure your pipe and figure this out or just sweep it. Keep going until you get motion. Oop, and there we go, right on 180. Notice the pressure waves here. They're lining up with the pressure waves. And down at the other end, no motion. That must be a node because it's a fixed end. This must be an anti-node because it's an open end. To prove that this is resonance, observe. That's how loud it is without the pipe. This is one quarter wavelength. Node, anti-node, the, the end of the anti-node would be 